this stage in my adventure, I'm realizing I need to take to the skies. Now, normally I'd do that with a German biplane or maybe a Zeppelin, but I don't have access to those, so I'm gonna give this a try. captain of this contraption here. Yes, I'm going to be your pilot. All right, and um, I had a look at it. It doesn't look that high tech though. It's very simple, but it flies really easy. All right, my only other question is about um, how we're we getting up there, because I brought this and I don't know if we... Well, we are going to use a line, okay? So we've actually got a line that's going to be connected to a little plane, and that plane's going to pull us up to 3,500 feet. So we're going to get to see the whole hinterland of the Gold Coast. So Lisa, how does it actually fly? Well, there's two main reasons it flies. One is Bernoulli's theory to do with high and low pressure. Okay, but the other theory is Newton's law. So every action, there's an equal and opposite reaction to do with angle of attack. Oh, Newton, I love Newton. In fact, that's why I want to go up in the air to look out for Newton's apple. Well, tell you what, we can find it on the hang glider. Alrighty. Well, here goes nothing. <laughs> So, apart from Newton, Lisa mentions some other physics at play here. It's shaped like an airfoil, just like a plane's wing. Okay, the top surface has got further to travel, so air moves over it faster, so it creates a low pressure, then so produces lift. So once we release off the tow line, we can go about 100 k's an hour, or we can actually go really slow, we can go about 30 k's an hour. All right, now it's my turn to steer. We've got complete control, just like you're flying a car. So if you want to go fast, you pull, it, pull the bar in and we can go fast. If we want to go slow, we push it out. If we want to go to the right, we just pull the right side into the hip and yep. then we're off to the right. So complete control, we can land it where we want. Aha, I think I've spotted something. Time to head back to Earth for more adventure.